Hi, uh, anyone who knows about collecting knows that uh, even if you do one video, you're forever changing things around. So, uh, basically what I've done is I've changed the statue round and round. Uh, I like it like this, so does everyone else in the house, so I must be doing something right. So, I'm going to turn the camera around and then we should take it from there. Thanks for watching. Please consider subscribing, liking and sharing. It does mean a lot to me. And uh, it really does. So let's turn the camera. So as you walk in the room, you've got my... That's a dragon picture I've done. That was in the last video. I've got a few autographs. Uh, different people. Obviously my commando bike. That's not my one, but it's a picture of it. Dave Prowse autograph, uh, Daisy Risley, Nick Hammond, and some Chitty Chitty Bang Bang cast. I don't have Dick Van Dyke yet, but I will do. Uh, basically, I paid a, mees um, a reasonable amount, but not over the top, so they're not genuine. I'm pretty sure that one's probably genuine. That's uh, Tommy Baldwin. Uh, and then what we've got is my TV set up here. This is like, a, it's not really a cinema room or theatre room. We've got a big TV in the other room we watch. But I've got some posters I've shown before. And my 40 inch 4K TV. So that's more for my 4K movies. If I... Uh, my missus or anyone else is watching the other TV and then we got some bits random there but they're stored and I can get to them really got my kind of statues from games a few plates and my rose that my wife bought me which I love to this day because I didn't know I was getting it and it was a nice surprise my favorite game Canvases that I did a video of getting from the charity shop. And my swords. And then we have, uh, they kind of hold the curtain back. So I've got my helmet from Killzone 3. And my mark from, uh, marker, sorry, from Gears of War. So what I'm going to do is just going to, sorry for that, I'm just going to kind of pan of the shape of the room so I've got my some boxes up there that I've got accessories in and that and then you've got some figures there original action man yeah him there I've had him for a long time and him not far behind so uh, they stay in my collection I, I did have a big action man collection which I did a video of but it's hard being a minimist and a collector and there's my Ray doing my custom antennae, antenna fixing and some figures here that I've got to do some reviews of and my Lord of the Rings and then we've just got a couple of figures up there my obviously Black Widow from Infinity War, the box for the Arkham Knight uh, Hot Toy, which I really love. And obviously 1966, uh, 1970s Linda Carter. And then you've got my Hot Toys there. My Batman, some fit toys down there, but I am, I love cars. Um... So that's my Batman related shelf. Bruce Lee. That is the uh, statues, collectibles. Quite happy how that corner's turned out. So my room's not that massive, but I try to use as much space. Obviously, I've got my premium format Batman. And my premium format Superman. I really love them. I love the capes. They're awesome. And then a space there for my custom Wonder Woman I've got coming. Once I've finished paying them off. 
down here we have my smaller kind of busts figures uh, some of these have been for a lot uh, obviously the Camberwick green ones some of them got busted uh, some of these Thunderbirds got damaged obviously my Jenner um, Jenner so General Ursies he got damaged but then you've still got Virgil and Thunderbird 2 there and Caesar there. So that's my, they're all together. So I'm quite happy with that. Um, I might consider putting another shelf on just to spread them out. But I'm not going to do another video just because I've done that. And then here we have my Star Wars corner. Got my custom Ray. Really love that piece. And then my premium format Luke Skywalker. Not everyone's cup of tea by the reviews i've seen of her but i really like him it gives that mood of him standing looking up to the uh, moons and that and then you've got ray doing the same at the end of rise of skywalker and a couple of uh, mini figures there darth vader everyone's got to have a darth vader i love darth vader and then my luke in his uh pilot outfit so my collection's a lot cleaner now it's not as my daughter did have my vintage toys they've all been put away primarily because they don't really display well i'm not getting rid of them they're all underneath there in boxes and um you know they're safe and so is the statues because they're actually on a wooden they're not on top of boxes I'm uh, very happy with it. Uh, what I'm going to do is I'm going to do an evening video uh, later on with the lights on so you'll get a comparison. But there's no point doing putting the lights on now because they're just going to be washed out. So I shall do that later on. So thanks for watching. Hope you enjoyed my video. As I say, it does mean a lot to me, people watching my videos. And uh, yeah, we shall see you in the next one. Bye for now.